Well, I stuck my hand in and there was this, uh, I don't know, it felt like wet eggplant. <laughs> you know, like if somebody steams it for like three hours, I reached in and I went, Ugh! <laughs> That is a term of texture I've never heard before. <laughs> it felt like wet eggplant. <laughs> I only went half a poopy today. Uh, it's it's one of those days. The game can't even poop at all. I'm blocked up. <laughs> block, blockity, block, block. We're talking major clumpage today. We're trying to get out of here and start this brand new video, but uh, Dame's trying to lay a clump and it ain't happening. You know, you want you don't want to start out the day, get out in the woods, and all of a sudden you get that twinkle. <laughs> twinkle. So, <laughs> the tinkle twinkle, <laughs> the tickled. <laughs> I had two lobsters and about two pounds of steamers yesterday afternoon. And then coffee and smoke this morning? Uh-huh, nothing. Yeah. That's gonna be a hard I'm growth. like four hours late. I'm telling you, it's gonna be the lowering the water balloon over the pin. I know this is bizarre talk, but everybody out there, well most of you, most of you are human, so we know you have these conversations. Yeah. So, really nothing out of the ordinary. No. no There's no. that book, Everybody Poops. <laughs> Except for Dame. Except for me. <laughs> Let's who, get out of here. Who gives a poop? All right, he gave the word. Let's get out of here. We're going back to where Keebs and I were recently, where the cufflinks came out as the culture. And a lot of other really great stuff. Yeah. That'll be the... Actually, we don't have a code name for that yet. Ooh. We'll, we'll wait till see if Dame has to <laughs> leave a penny today or not. Right. <laughs> Let's roll. Is this it? I, we've landed somewhere. No, I mean, you touching cloth? No, 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 I, 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 uh, I'm, I'm needing pills for my head. Oh, oh, okay. Just pills at this point. You gonna orbit this time? Yes, most definitely. Right. Going to go where the wildwood weed grows. Do what I can do, what I can do. Let's go. Where the wild things are? I was just popping my head in the woods here. The usual, take a look around. It's found the top of a mason jar. That's definitely old, and I think I hear Sam Squanch over there. Well, I just turned my detector on walking in. I'm about 20 feet from the cellar hole. The only problem is those numbers. Remember that cap I dug last time here? Let's find out. Oh, no! Ah! <laughs> oh, and again, you're at the brick level. Look what's right next to it. A brick. Now that's culture. Wow. Talk about a culture. Now see, the other day with the 77, 78 numbers, you never know. All right, I'm out of here. Talk to you guys later. Have a good dig. Yeah, bye. All right, Dame's got a culture signal of, what'd you say, 61? 61. Right in the lip. Lead button. Nice. I winged it. Neato. Very good. And I'll tell you, we went by this side of the lip several times. Heard nothing. Well, there's something. And like I said to Dame the other day, uh, we were having RF interference because of the electrical storms. These machines operate down in the kilohertz. Real, real low frequency and they were just chattering all day. I found nothing on this side of the lip. So, very good. Beautiful. Yeah. What was it? Tarantula. Yeah. I just saved your life. Oh, nice. Yeah, iron. It's neat. It's a little bit flared. It's old. Definitely. Yeah, I heard you tickle that. It actually sounded pretty clean. <laughs> well, it's been some time. We've all tried orbiting. 
thick out there. Wicked thick. And we haven't found anything else. I hope I didn't give us the 30 second curse with that buckle. <laughs> it, it is kind of interesting that with a recap of a site that had so much activity the first shot, you think we would have found more, but... It's quiet and thick. Yeah. Scratches, cobwebs, bugs in the mouth. Yeah, do you need a porta potty yet? No, I'm, I feel like I have already. <laughs> so that's kind of doom. <laughs> Dangerous. Yeah. Alright, well maybe Keebs did a reverse of the curse. But this makes one target per person since we've been here. Oh yeah, huh? Nail with it? <laughs> yeah. Wow. So, two options. We either pound this silly, take a drive up the road and see if we can find that other one. I was just going to work this area and surprisingly that's where I found the other button out here. My first target of the site. Well, yeah. Give this a few more minutes and we'll yeah. split the difference. Alright, All right, so maybe the maybe the situation is changing. Dame just yelled out that he got a first for himself. My very first thimble. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Yay! Awesome. That is awesome. Field tool extraction, huh? Uh-huh. Well, I stuck my hand in and there was this, uh, I don't know, it felt like wet eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like if somebody steams it for like three hours, I reached in and I went, <laughs> That is a term of texture I've never heard before. <laughs> it felt like wet eggplant. <laughs> I can feel it. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what too. you mean. Uh, That's what you're going to have later on when you clump. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to destroy a restroom on the highway. <laughs> First. Nice job. Right under the apple tree. Oh, he wants to race. He doesn't go over the road, he is going to. He'll be popping out right up here. Right? <laughs> here we go! <laughs> wow! <laughs> For the record, people, we weren't chasing. We actually probably just saved his life because he was trying to cross earlier. Yeah. We spotted him and gave him the right away. Now, I want to know who get the deer. We're back at the shack because we did not find what it was that we were looking for. Yeah. But speaking of finds, you know how we always mention future finds? That's when you find something, but you don't find out until the future as to what it is. We had a moment last night. Check out Dame. Okay, so it is actually three years and maybe a month and some days later. We're at the shack. I'm cleaning relics and I'm going through my pile of slick ricks. Now, back at the buckets episode when we took Trooper Bry out, I dug a coin which had detail on it until shortly after it came out of the ground dried out and we haven't been able to see anything. Whoa. Oh. I think we may have bingo. Hmm. You want to eyeball it for me? What's that? That would be um, things and stuff and all that was. <laughs> Here we are, fast forward, three plus years, flash a light on it, we can see some detail. Give it to Dame, who's become quite the identifier of slickageness. <laughs> he ID'd the damn coin. Took me about five minutes online. Saw a couple of details that were very unique. Definitely not British, not early American. We we're thinking French, German, whatever. Turns out <clears throat> it is a 1749 Swedish Frederick the First two or coin. Uh, it is marked two or 
SM, which uh, means two or silver mint, although it is a copper coin and minted as such. So how did it get here? That's the question. And that's that's really what makes it cool, because 1749, not a lot of Swedes coming over on mass. Yeah, talk about a future find. Well, I can take that off my list, you know? Good job. Yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. It's an awesome coin, and, and there's there's mystery behind it, and uh, only 313,000 minted, so. Yeah, and it's not that often we get to flash back to our own videos with things like that, so. Thank you. Thank you, man. So, good job. Thank you for IDing my coin. Oh, it's my pleasure. Definitely awesome. I never would have ever thought of finding something like that. I know. Yeah. Frederick the First. Who would have thunk it? Yeah. Not a bad recap today. A little lighter than we would have expected, but still a few good finds. We got to see a deer. Oh, dear. And, uh... That's it. It's another Not Thursday. <laughs> oh! Oh. Uh-oh. Anything. Before we go, any activity? None whatsoever. No urges, no percolating. So maybe tomorrow morning. Oh, I hope so. <laughs> Either that or it'll hit me smack dab between rest areas mm -hmm. on the drive home. Yeah. Well, I'll be sweating. And... Good luck. Yeah. Thanks. You want to take a pan with you? <laughs> <laughs> Diaper? <laughs> we better just end it right now.